What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. Today I am so excited to finally be back after 5 months. I know it's been a very very long time but stay tuned. I have a review for you on Glambot and my experience with them. Alright guys, so finally welcome back. We're gonna go ahead and start off about what Glambot is. Um, I found out about Glambot um, through Facebook. One day I was on Facebook and then I saw their ad pop up. Um, so I decided to click on it because I was like, oh, discounted makeup, like let me see what's going on with that. And it wasn't just regular makeup. These are like high name brands, Morphe, um, you know, all of them. Like, so I was just like, let me go see what this is about. So I clicked on it and then I was like, wow, they have a lot of nice stuff on her for cheap prices. Not knowing before I purchased these things that Glambot buys things from people and resells it. So this isn't a bad thing because some the quality of their stuff is really, really good. Um, I'm gonna show you a few of the palettes that I got because I only bought eyeshadow palettes from them as you know I wanted to experiment with eyeshadow and different looks and I created this look today with one of the palettes So stay tuned and I'll show you All right guys, so this um, the first palette I got was a Mylan Pony palette and it's by Colourpop And this is the palette right here. This is exactly how it came excellent condition like for a secondhand product and then in the inside, this is like what it looks like. So perfect condition, like not one mess up. I haven't even used this palette yet and it's, it looks amazing. All right guys, so that's one palette. I was really, really excited about getting this one, mind you, because I wanted it when it was on Colourpop's website, but then I ended up not getting it because I think they sold out of it. So yeah, that was the reason for that. And then the next palette I got is this Morphe palette by Jaclyn Hill. So this palette is really, really nice as well. It has like a lot of, I would say, earth tone colors, really, really good. So this is what it looks like, and this is exactly how it came to me. So you can see that someone did use it a bit, but um, otherwise than that, it's in excellent condition. I mean, I really, truly would recommend Glambot because from what I'm seeing is, it's like, why would you go and spend all this money on name brand products when you can get them at a discounted price? And yeah, it's second hand, but I wouldn't go for like things like lipsticks, etc. Because I think that's kind of gross. You don't know people's lips to be in. But with this, you're literally just putting a brush in and I'm putting it on your eyes. So I don't think it's that bad. And you can always sanitize eyeshadows. So that's why I don't think it's a big deal in terms of the eyeshadow. And plus, when you go to makeup artists, what do you think a makeup artist is doing? She's doing the same thing, dipping a brush in from all different people and putting it on your face. So like, it's not a big deal. The other thing I got is this Carly Vibel um, BH Cosmetics palette and I was really interested in this one because it actually had highlighter um, palette, it had highlighter um, things in it, I guess you could say palette, palettes. So um, yeah, in her, there's another like afternoon palette because I don't really go all extravagant with my makeup. I know today this is kind of like the most I would do on myself but on a normal day, it's pretty much regular earth tones, bronze and golds. I don't really like to go all out with colors and everything. So yeah, these are the highlighters and this is how it came. Excellent condition, still able to be used. So yeah, I don't see why um, it was like controversy on people's orders with um, Glambot. Maybe they had a few mistakes when they first started and then, I don't know, maybe they um, fixed it. I really don't know what it is, what it could be. But um, here is the Sweet Nothings palette by Colourpop. This is another palette that I got from them. And I really love this palette because of the like pink tones. And I always wanted like a rose girly look, which is kind of like what I tried to create today, but not quite. Um, and here the palette is amazing. Like honestly, not touched, looks brand new to me. Like I love it. Like I would, I think I would shop for eyeshadow palettes from Glambot again. Okay, so I'm getting to the bigger palettes. The bigger palettes, which are the ones that I was a little bit disappointed with just because of how they came to me. This one, obviously you can tell someone was pre, it was pre-owned because it's all scratched up on here. And then when I opened it up, you can see that it's broken right here. But otherwise than that, the colors are fine. You could still, it's still able to be used. And like the first one I noticed was used was that one. So I could tell that somebody was using that. 
um but otherwise than that i feel like it still looks pretty brand new and still really good to be used and this is a smoky eye palette so i will be using this one soon this one i was truly disappointed about just because when i opened it up it was like i don't know if this is because of the shipping and people throwing around the um box or whatever the case may be but when i opened it these two were broken so i had to literally clean it up you can see some of it still um on the inside and i was kind of upset about those two shades but it's all right today i actually created this look that i have on um with this palette and my eyelashes are from Iman Artistry on Instagram. Make sure you go check them out. She has some really, really nice eyelashes. And she's also a makeup artist and she like does a lot of people's makeup. I think she's done Ruby Rose's makeup, loads of Bermudians makeup. Um, so if you ever need a makeup artist, make sure you go and check her out. And like I said, these are her lashes in the style Queen. I don't know if I put them on correctly. You know, I'm not a makeup expert, but you know, today I was just trying something out. But yeah. So that's my video. But thanks guys for tuning in again to my channel. I hope you like this video on Glam Butt. And if you're interested, make sure you go and check out their website. They have loads of different things, not just eyeshadows. Um, and I'm pretty sure you guys will find something that you might like on that website. But if you like this video today, make sure you hit that like button. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. And don't forget to hit the bell for post notifications. And make sure you comment because I do comment back to all my subscribers. I love subscribers. I love meeting new people. So yes, make sure you do that. And I'll see you guys in the next video.